What's in your hands right now? Your phone, a ring, your watch, that pen? Everything we have, everything we use, everything we hold in our hands was either grown or mined. Even the salt in your cheese and cracker. Mining isn't a declining nostalgic remnant of an outdated economy. It's a vibrant, burgeoning industry, a leader in innovation and community building. And it has long been an engine of growth in Ontario, moving our province forward by harnessing the natural resources we are privileged to find beneath us. Let's look a little deeper into the important role mining continues to play in driving Ontario's economy and green transition. Minerals and metals aren't optional, they're essential. While we work to eliminate fossil fuels from our economies around the world, critical minerals are the cornerstone of the innovative technologies that enable a green economy. Copper, nickel, lithium, cobalt, platinum group metals, and rare earth elements are essential components in batteries, computers and medical devices, wind turbines and solar farms, electricity grids, and electric vehicles. As the race to address climate change accelerates, Ontario is poised to become a key provider of the critical minerals that will make this possible, with 37 mines currently in production and hundreds of sites being actively explored for their mineral potential. Mining creates rewarding careers that contribute significantly to the Ontario economy and build strong communities. Mining wages are consistently around 60% higher than the typical industrial wage, attracting skilled workers that build prosperous futures for their families across the province. Ontario mining companies are actively adopting emerging technologies like artificial intelligence, augmented reality and infrastructure connected through the Internet of Things. These investments in technology, the environment and health and safety encourage entrepreneurship, research and education in the communities that support our mines and mills. And while mining provides direct employment for more than 29,000 workers in the province, the industry supports another 27,000 indirect mining jobs and has a cascading effect throughout a larger mining cluster, supporting thousands of additional jobs that multiply across the economy. Of the total annual revenues of more than $10 billion, including more than $3.7 billion in total worker compensation, nearly 77% of mining GDP contributions stay in Ontario, supporting communities and industries throughout the province. Because while many people associate the industry exclusively with Northern Ontario, the truth is mining activities and related services are located across Ontario. Our annual economic contribution extends across every region in the province, bringing $3.3 billion in GDP to the Sudbury area, $1.5 billion to the Northwest region, $1.7 to Ontario's Northeast, and more than a billion dollars in GDP to Southern Ontario. It's an industry that has also made Toronto a financial and business hub for mining investment worldwide, with 43% of the world's publicly traded mining companies listed on either the TSX or TSXV, and a total traded value of more than $2.5 billion a year. Communities are as important to our future as we can be to theirs. Over 140 active agreements reflect the collaborative relationships we have forged with our Indigenous partners, in addition to the resource revenue sharing agreements with Ontario that allow First Nations to share in the economic benefits of forestry and mining operations near their communities. Mining has one of the highest proportions of Indigenous workers of all industries in Ontario, with First Nations representing 11% of direct mining jobs, as well as a growing number of services and supply companies. All the while, the larger communities with a history of mining in Ontario, like Sudbury, Timmins and Thunder Bay, have grown into vibrant, world-class cities. Ontario mining companies continue to play a leading role in innovation, health and safety and environmental stewardship, with our operations among the cleanest and safest in the world. We're setting the highest standards of environmental stewardship and sustainability, spending more than $120 million a year on clean technology and energy efficiency. Over 80% of our member companies have established carbon emission targets, with 40% setting long-term zero emission goals. Most of our operating mines are connected to the Ontario Electricity Grid, which generates 95% of its power from zero carbon sources. And more than two-thirds of the water used in our operations is now recycled. Ontario is one of the safest mining jurisdictions in the world, and one of the safest industries in Ontario. In the 35 years from 1975 to 2010, the Ontario mining industry achieved a 96% improvement in lost time injury frequency and today performs significantly better than the WSIB industry average. The tens of millions of dollars we continue to invest in health and safety are setting new standards and changing the way we operate. 
Increasing use of autonomous and remotely operated vehicles in high-risk environments, for example, has made us world leaders in these emerging technologies, while creating a safer workplace for our people. The future is bright for the mining industry in Ontario. We have strong, accountable governments, a diverse and skilled workforce, and a reliable regulatory system. And as an industry, we are committed to environmental sustainability and good governance, to safety and community building. These competitive advantages continue to attract customers from around the world, and the investment that will enable our continued long-term growth and prosperity. Ontario mines are essential to meeting worldwide goals for decarbonization and a lower global carbon footprint. Our future will be defined by our ability to inspire and invest in the next generation of mining talent and challenge them to bring their creativity and collaborative gusto to the sustainable, world-class industry we are destined to be.